What's up guys? This is a real simple, straightforward video on how to change the transmission oil on your CR125. This is an 03 CR125. Um, they are pretty much exactly the same, 02 to 04, and you change the transmission oil the same on basically every model that was ever made. So um, we're gonna start off by draining the old oil. And it may help if you start it up first, get it warm, thin out that oil a little bit, you drain a little more out. So we're gonna do that first. Okay, now we're up underneath. That is your transmission drain bolt. It's a 17 millimeter. So we're just gonna back that off, drain everything out. Now it's got like a grayish, like a grayish tint to it. That's what it gets from uh, clutch fiber material and stuff like that. It's was well, definitely due for a change. Um, you don't have to change this near as often as you would engine oil or something in a four stroke, but uh, it is the life of your clutches uh, and the life of your transmission. So, you know, for six, eight bucks, you're crazy not to change this as often as you can. We're gonna let this drain out. Okay, we've got our old fluid drain. Put the drain plug back in there. And guys, you want to just be smart when you're tightening this. Um, you don't want to leave it loose, but you don't need to. Uh, sorry about that. You don't need to torque the crap out of it either, uh, because honestly, it's better that this fall out or get loose and drip than it is for you to strip this out. And then, you know, I've seen entire bikes junked because of this getting stripped. So, get it tight and then just go just a smidge more. And it's not going anywhere. Okay. Now, we just got to put the new stuff in. Okay. Right here is your filler cap. Right here, it tells you how much to put in there. Uh, doesn't tell you this on all bikes, but most of the modern two strokes it does tell you right there so your oil filler cap just comes off by hand it's got a little o-ring on it 650 centimeters cubed okay guys centimeters cubed is virtually the same thing as milliliters so or cc's they're basically all the same thing so i've got a measuring cup here with uh, milliliters or cc's on it um, i measured out 500 because that's all will fit in here i'm going to put 500 in then I'll measure out another 650, and that will give me my, or I mean another 150, and that will give me my 650 total. I'm using Maxima 1040. Um, use whatever you want. Any 1040 that's wet clutch specific, motorcycle specific, will work fine. Um, you don't need to, there's really no reason to run synthetic in a two-stroke transmission. But if this was a four stroke, uh, I always run synthetic in mine. Sometimes you can even uh, use the kicker there to hold the funnel for you. Oh, oh, sorry. All right, so that's our 500. I'm gonna measure out another 150. all drained in and we are in pretty good shape guys so 
took the oil filler cap, make sure it's clean. Get it back on here. This doesn't have to be super tight either because obviously it's not gonna fall anywhere. It's got an O-ring to seal. So just snug and you're good. You've just changed the oil on your CR125. Thanks for watching.